All right, so I'm gonna try to make this simple and help some people out. This is the Yes Calm awning from Amazon. It is a clone of an ARB awning and I mounted it with the roof mounts. The bracket is sandwiched in between the upper bar and the crossbars. And I just had to drill two new holes in here and then everything mounted right up. So as I mentioned, this is the Yes Come awning, the first piece of the puzzle. And this is the second piece of the puzzle, ARB awning, 2000 by 25. And it matches up with this Yes Come awning from Amazon perfectly. That is brand name. That is not, but it is a clone of the ARB awning. So first step, deploy it. So that's step one, deploy the awning. This flap has a zipper and is included with the actual ARB screen room. There's a groove in the awning and you remove this screw and that screw, take this plastic cap off and this flap with zipper slides right in there, screw it back on and you can leave it there. The second thing you have to do is where the groove is here, on the one closest to the camper, there's a cap and I actually had to trim that so it stays open. That's the only thing I had to modify to make it stay up there. So the next step is you grab your awning bag or awning room, roll it out and you'll put it up. I'll put it on time-lapse. There is a little rail that slides into the groove here. It slides across and that's what hangs it there. And you do all your clips and put it up. All right, all set up, like I said earlier, zips across there. You've got clips across the top that snap onto the poles. I haven't done the Velcro. And you can see this little piece that is attached to the tent slides into that groove. Room itself, you've got zipper door like this on both sides. And you can have it as a screen room or walls down, full enclosure. It has its own roof and the floor. So completely sealed from rain. It does have a door here for made for vehicles so you can access a car door. I like it. You can use the trailer lights. So other people with this camper in Tech Explore. It's not sealed to the camper, but if you have the double barn door, you definitely could have one door open and passing through. I obviously don't have a double barn door. Let's uh, see what the ramp does. Little flip there, and a flip there. And we're catching at the bottom. Ramp door does not work. So hope that helps somebody that asks. But other than that, ramp door doesn't work. I do believe that the double barn door would definitely clear and you could pass in and out with minimal rain coming in and out of there, but that's not what I wanted this for. I wanted it for a full enclosure to be out of the rain or a full enclosure screen room for bugs and stuff. I think this will do great for me. So ARB screen room awning, the actual brand, works with the Yescom awning from Amazon. It's about a third of the price of the ARB brand name awning, so I think it's gonna do what I want it to do. Hopefully that helps some other people figure out what they want. Last thing I thought I'd mention, it does have spots to stake everything on the corners where I'm currently sitting. It's higher because of the drop down there. Um, this does pull down a good little bit more. I don't think it'll be an issue for my setup with the Explore Camper for people that are trying to use it that way. Um, but yeah, stakes all out, you can guy wire it and no problems, but as far as the height with this specific camper, the Intec Explorer, doesn't seem to be a problem. Little stretched out, you gotta step over the wall, but not really a big deal.